Rookie, read about geography, latitude and longitude. What are the lines for on a map or globe? The lines on a map or globe help you read the map or globe. These lines make a grid. Some of the lines go across. Some of the lines go up and down. Look at this map. It also uses a grid. Do you see Bear Cave? To find it, follow line 2. Down. Follow line C across. Bear Cave is where lines 2 and C meet. A long time ago, map makers decided to use a grid. They drew lines on maps and globes of the world. The lines helped explorers and others to find their way. Explorers are people who travel to new places. We still use the same lines today. We call them latitude and longitude lines. The lines are numbered and have a degree sign after them. Latitude lines go across a map or around a globe. They run east and west. Latitude lines are shortest at the north and south poles. They get longer as they reach the middle of the earth. North Pole, South Pole. North Pole, Northern Hemisphere, Equator, Southern Hemisphere, South Pole. The equator is the latitude line that circles the middle of the Earth. It divides Earth into northern and southern hemispheres. A hemisphere is half a sphere. An orange cut in half has two hemispheres. Longitude lines go up and down on a map or globe. They run north and south. Longitude lines get closer together at the top or bottom of a map or globe. They meet at the North and South Poles. North Pole, South Pole. North Pole, Eastern Hemisphere, Prime Meridian. Western Hemisphere, South Pole. The Prime Meridian is the first longitude line. All other longitude lines are numbered starting there. The Prime Meridian divides Earth into Eastern and Western Hemispheres. Latitude and longitude lines are important to sailors and pilots. They use the lines to find their way. You can use these lines too. Look at this picture. The fingers are pointing to a place. What is the name of the place? What is the latitude? Use a map to find out. Words you know. Equator. Grid. Hemisphere. Latitude. Longitude. Pilots. Prime Meridian.